Ah, Phelps. I was just discussing with Finbar here how well you were doing. Have a seat. Yeah, my real name. And you can just forget all about it. You boys have a new case. A poor Hispanic woman murdered near City Hall and left lying naked in an alleyway. Another naked woman, sir? Yes. We seem to have had quite a run of them since the Dahlia fiend first struck. Phelps is politely trying to hint that he thinks the Mendes case is hokey. Well, young Phelps, you win some and you lose some in police work. You're happy with the Mueller case, sir? Over the moon, boys! The DA couldn't be more pleased with the evidence, the witness, and the lack of an alibi. Now, get out there and catch me another sinner. Hey, Cole, let's get moving. That's the guy from the papers. Solved that big case. You call these grits? That's one heck of a Sunday. Detectives, they're ready to start the show. I'll take you through. Brothers, Pinker. The cause of death is pretty apparent. We thought we'd best wait for you when you're ready. The lacerations on the neck would indicate a great deal of force. Kiss the blood, BD. Only 21 years old. But why the library card? Did he want us to find it? The evidence in the Mueller case was solid. I'm not convinced about Mendez. The best way to get away with murder is to pin it on somebody else. I'll bet a month's salary this is a copycat. Strangled, battered, Yeah, naked. yeah, yeah, we know the M.O. So does every jerk who kills his wife and girlfriend looking for a way out. I've spoken to Brown. He still believes the Dahlia perp has medical experience. Four women, all murdered, all put on display, all with messages. Mueller had no message. Look, Phelps, this is getting us nowhere. Anything for us to go on, Mel? Head injuries from contact with road, bruising from a small man's shoe, further blunt force trauma to the occipital region at the base of the skull. Could have been fatal, but clear signs of strangulation would seem to rule it out. Lipstick appears to be a similar color to the other cases. I'll see if I can nail down a brand. Another wedding ring torn from the finger. No skin under the fingernails. If she took a blow to the head like the others, she was probably unconscious when strangled. the library card.
proximity to the scene, plus the bloodstains, no way is this coincidence. We kept the area pristine for you boys. Let's check it out. House keys strung up like bait on a hook. You think he's trying to lead us somewhere? Probably all the way to City Hall, that brazen son of a bitch. That's got to be a code or a cipher. Are you taking us? Empty. Where is all of this meant to be taking us? Clearly wants us to find these things. He's left them for us. There you go, Phelps. We got a new M.O. I told you it wasn't our guy. Or he might just be getting more confident. Enameled and gold-plated. This was precious to her. The trail points up. Pulled from the finger and hung up here. What's the significance? Looks as though the killer was decorating with this. Son of a bitch wants her identified. Mrs. Antonia Maldonado, 712 North Hill Street, downtown.
against the rules of drive like this without a sign. Sorry, can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Detective Phelps and Galloway. Does Mrs. Maldonado live here? Yes, she does. I'm Mrs. Barbara Lepente, the owner of this boarding house. Is there a problem? I'm afraid so, ma'am. Do you mind if we come in? Is there somewhere we can discuss this? Of course. Follow me through to the parlor. Wop your feet as you come in, detectives. It's this way. Mrs. Maldonado was found dead this morning. Dead? Oh, no. She can't be. I'm afraid she was murdered, ma'am. We need to take a look at her things. I can't believe it. A person seems so alive, and then they're gone. Antonia's room is upstairs, last door on the left. Thank you. We'll be back shortly. Uh, excuse us a moment, ma'am. Look at that. Someone's turned the place over. A smashed window explains why the place looks tossed. So someone broke in using this thing instead of a crowbar. I wonder where it was taken from. You know how I feel about windows, Phelps. Okay, we have an address. The charm bracelet wasn't among the crime scene evidence. We have some questions, ma'am, if you're up to it. Yes, detective. I'll do my best. Do you have any idea who might have wanted to hurt Mrs. Maldonado? That rat of her husband, Angel. 
She was serving him divorce papers. If I killed every wife to serve me papers, I'd be a mass murderer. Are you being flippant, young man? No, ma'am. What can you tell us about Angel Maldonado? She married him when she was 17. He was cruel to her, very cruel. She was a good girl, little on the religious side, but a good girl. What time did Antonia go out yesterday? She left around nine. Do you know where she went? No, I, I have no idea. She was a good girl, but she didn't confide in me. A nosy old hag like you knows everything about the people who live under her roof. Where did she go? I think she went to a bar. She's been drinking quite a lot lately. This bar have a name? El Dorado Bar. It's a Latino place on North Los Angeles Street. That's only a couple of blocks from where we found the body. You've had a break-in? No. That can't be true. You're being economical with the truth, Mrs. Lepenti. What do you have to hide? I have no idea what you are talking about. So Antonia lost her keys and used an iron bar to jimmy the back window? I heard a noise in the early hours of the morning. I thought it might be a raccoon at the milk bottles. It'd be very bad for business if this news got out. I have a reputation to protect. Antonia and her husband were estranged? Yes. She moved here after she separated from her husband two months ago. But Antonia still wore a wedding ring? She wore the wedding ring and a necklace. She always wore a religious necklace. That's about all of her jewelry. What about her bracelet? I don't know anything about a bracelet. In her wedding photo, she's displaying a charm bracelet. I think she never wore it. He gave it to her. She always kept it in that wooden jewelry box. Thanks, ma'am. You've been very helpful. Pay a call to that husband of hers. Lock him up and throw away the key. The hired help at the El Dorado might have seen the broad the night she died. Maybe the regulars, too. You should check it out. Aldonado is in apartment 304.
Well, this could turn ugly. Forget about knocking. Let's take our boy by surprise. Hey, what the fuck? LAPD, motherfucker. You're under arrest. staring at me like that. Damn. They got some decent shots in there. Cop these sons of bitches, Phelps. LAPD, you two are under arrest. Call for some backup, Finbar. Galloway, badge number 564. I need a prowl car at the apartment building 330 North Hill Street. Two suspects need transporting to Central. Your wife has been murdered, Angel. Antonia? Oh, God, no! Where were you last night, Angel? I was here with my brother the whole night, God damn it! You think I killed my own wife? You get the whole place is going over. Then talk to me. Sir, do you work here? Sorry, pal, just making deliveries. From where? Just big fruit market across the street. Fruit market? 